What is up, FIFA Tube? It's your boy Weep Healer in the house here to give you my first ever FIFA commentary. I've done a few commentaries before, mostly on the Hophog HD PVR setup and Dazzle and all that good capture card stuff. Haven't done one on FIFA, so here it is. Hope you guys enjoy it. Getting some messages on my videos on what type of sweaty team I use for uh, FIFA Ultimate Team. Here it is. Here's the uh, lineup for my awesome record. I'll show you my squads. Well, my squad, because I've only got one. I do mainly Premiership side with Syria Strikers, except for Fred. I like my boy Fred. Holla, holla. So, yeah, I've been using him since FIFA 08, I believe, when I did a lot of manager mode, and I built my own team. And Fred was my first acquisition. He was a younger guy then. He was tall, big, uh, skillful. So, I got to inform Reyna. This guy is a beast. Got to say, I stole him for about 70 three and a half thousand coins uh, he's awesome he's got really good stats good diving good handling good kicking good reflex everything except the acceleration uh, which you don't really need I guess for a goalkeeper uh, his positioning is good enough that he can usually get into the right spots and do what he needs to do to stop the ball he's good he's beast I like him I can't say enough about him uh, I did steal him I think because I got I think the records were like 130,000 coins. Him and Check were up there. Uh, I went with Reyna because he was a little cheaper. And like I said, I was able to steal him for 73,000 coins. So there you go. Got Company and Terry in the back. Center backs, I like them. Uh, Vincent Company is awesome. He is quite pacey for a center back. Most center backs are not. He's got a good, uh, good heading too. Uh, or decent heading, I should say. Good defending. You know, good player. I like him a lot. Terry, obviously, is a beast. Guy's a freaking animal. Strength is ridiculous. His pace is terrible, so he's slower. He's on the slower side, but his heading is really good, so he stays in the middle of the box. Gets the ball out when he needs to. Uh, I like him. I use him uh, quite often. I mix him and Lescott, though. Lescott's on my bench right now. But All right, Michael Richards is my right back. This guy is a beautiful player. Pacey for a, a wing. Uh, I like him, so... Defending is pretty good. His heading's pretty good. Heading on the wing is, eh, you know, give or take. I'm more about the pace on the wing, so I like Michael Richards. Cheap. I got him for how many thousand coins here? Yeah, 2,500, so good. Definitely worth the purchase. Over on left back, Mr. Patrice Evra. Sick. I can't say enough about him. Quick, super pacey. I like that for the wing. Again, he's awesome with defending and, and got a good header, too. Uh, like I said before, you don't need too much on the, the heading for a winger, but I do like the uh, pace that he provides. He's a good, strong guy. Very nice. Good player. Awesome. Ah, Mr. Nani. Freaking awesome. I think he's probably my favorite favorite ultimate team player. Him and Fred, I, I love him. I, I gotta say, this guy's five-star skill move. Disgustingly fast. Inform especially. This is the first inform. I think there's another one in 86 or team of the year, but this guy is just ridiculous. Pace is awesome. Five-star skill moves. Shooting is ridiculous. Uh, his passing is good too. He's got sick dribbling, obviously, five-star skill move, but it's mainly the pace. You can blow by anybody on the wing with him. Uh, do a couple skills and blast it in from a long way because he has got the shot to do it. Nani, my my man, my main man. A lot of my goals in my FIFA minutes have come from Nani. This guy is just ridiculous. And David Silva, center mid. A little on the weak side. Does get beat off the ball quite easily, but his stats don't lie. He's really, really good, balanced player. Quick, quick pace. Good shot. Does quite a good long shot with the left foot. Uh, his passing, obviously, is pretty good. He's more a playmaker than a scorer, I think. His dribbling's good. Four-star skill move, not five-star, so you can't pull off some of the greater stuff with him. But good player. I like him. Didn't get him for uh, too expensive. I mean, I got him probably a few months ago, so 13-8 wasn't too bad. But he's since dropped. You could probably get him for maybe 7,000 now. Nasri, my other center mid. Uh, I swapped these guys, both Silva and Nasri, with Milner. I'll show you later. He's in my bench right now because he's, I think he got a red card. But Nasri's nasty. He, I got him for 13.5. His stats are crazy. Um, I'm not sure if there's an inform. I think there is. I would probably get him, but I, I the net, regular Nasri's good enough. Pretty pacey, not too bad in 84. His shot's good. His passing's awesome. Dribbling, 90, but I think he's only 4-star skill move. I don't think he's 5. Uh, I can't pull off any great stuff with him. I have a little bit of difficulty scoring with the guy, but I'm able to get a few goals in the past few games with him. So, I like him. Nasri's not too shabby. Pretty good player. Big. I like him. Ben Arfa. Left freaking shot is unreal. This dude is a beast. He's 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 awesome. I love him. Five ten. 
pretty pacey, not too shabby. Shot's deceptive. 75, I would say, is on the lower end. This guy has got a bullet. He can freaking shoot him in from far. He can do five-star skill moves so he can get by people on the wing. Uh, really, really good player. Good acquisition. Got him for cheap, 3,000 coins. Uh, I think I got him from Phil Pato's video. I saw a five-star skill move on the wing. He was blasting him in from everywhere on the PlayStation, so I'm like, hey, why not try him for the Xbox? But Ben Arfa, awesome. Good real life, too. Gets injured quite often, but I hope he has a good career because he's got potential. Now on to my strikers. Ha, ha, ha. Inform Fred and Inform Lavetti. We'll talk about Lavetti first because... I like him. <laughs> sick player, sick pace, crazy shot, five-star skill move, uh, un unbelievable. He's on the shorter side. I think he's only, yeah, 5'8", so he's a, he's a little guy, but, man, is he quick, and, and he just keeps the ball at his feet, and, and he can blast him in from long range. He can do crazy sick skill moves. Got it for 70,000. At the time, that was a steal. It's probably uh, lower now, but that was actually a pretty good price when I got him. Inform Fred. This guy is just ridiculous. Uh, one of my subscribers actually traded me my regular Fred for my Inform Fred. So, as you can see, I didn't buy him for anything. I got him for an even swap. Thank you, subscriber. SB Inspiration. Awesome, sick, uh, sick trade right there. Regular Fred for Inform Fred. Stats went up a little. The pace goes up. The shot goes up. Heading is good because he's a tall guy. I think he's yeah six one. So pretty good stuff. Um, Inform Fred. Five star skill moves. His stats lie, too. I mean, this guy's an absolute beast. He can really, really play. Uh, he is on the slower side, but, you know, if the shot makes up for it, five-star skill moves make up for it. I like him up front. I typically flop him and Cavani uh, when, you know, Fred's tired, but onto my bench. Lescott, the man with the scar. This dude got hit when he was five years old by a car and got dragged down the road. I didn't know that. I looked him up because I, I wanted to know why he got the scar, but awesome player, man. Um, tall, really strong. Decent pace for center back at 73, but his heading is good. Uh, any ball that comes into the box, he's pretty much able to get it out. Defending's pretty good, too, at 78. So I like Lescott. I swap him with Terry and with company when they need to break. Cavani, this guy, man. Pert Plus commercial and the headband. I love Cavani. He's awesome. Wicked pace. Wicked shot. Uh, he's great, man. He's tall. He's a little skinny. He's not real strong. Passing does kind of blow, but he's a good dribbler. Four-star skill move, not five-star. Good on the header because he's a tall guy, but his pace and his shot are just unreal. I mean, I got him for pretty cheap, too. Yeah, 1,900 coins. I mean, I thought that was a steal. I still think that's a steal. I would pay 1,900 coins for that guy 10 times over. So, Edison Cavani. He's on the bench right now, but I do swap him, swap him with Fred. Good player. David Bentley. Yeah, the man with the hot girlfriend and a kid. And she won't marry you, dude. Sorry, Bentley. Um, I, think you, uh, I think she's waiting for you to decline so she can... Steal some younger footballer. Good player, David Bentley. Sick free kicks. Kept him on my team. Uh, he was my original gold star right uh, right mid. Excellent player. Uh, I stole him for, yeah, 650 coins. He's sick. Uh, decent pace. Not a great shot, but decent. Good at passing, good at dribbling. Four-star skill move, not five-star. The dude has a wicked, wicked free kick, though. Uh, excellent bend. Good power on it. I used him for free kicks when uh, I didn't have Ben Arfa in my right mid. Frank Ribery. I like him. I don't use him too much because I have uh, Nani. Good player. I got him. I forgot how I got him. I got him in a pack, I think. Yeah, he's, you know, decent. I mean, the stats, I think they lie. I don't think they're. he's actually that good in FIFA. But 90 pace, he, he is pretty fast. I don't think he's anywhere near as fast as Nani. Um, his shot's pretty good. Passing's pretty good. I think he's five-star skill move, maybe four-star skill move. I don't know. I don't use him a ton, so I can't really tell you uh, much about him. I do keep him on the bench in case Nani gets hurt. Uh, Nani tends to get hurt quite often, but yeah, Ribery, all right. Not 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 the greatest player in my opinion, but pretty good. Tevez, the pit bull, the bulldog. Tevez. I like this guy. He's pretty good. I do swap him in with uh, Lavezzi and, and Fred. Lavezzi I tend to keep in. I, I buy, like, cards if he gets hurt and whatnot. Um, I like to not keep him out because I spent the most on him, but Tevez, good striker. Uh, sometimes I'll put him up front with Cavani, too, because they have good uh, good chemistry next to each other. Wait, no, they don't. I lied. Never mind. Sometimes I keep Tevez in <laughs> with uh, with uh, Lavezzi because they have good chemistry because they're n n Argentinian. Good player. Uh, beast, a little on the short side, but his shot is ridiculous. His pace is pretty good. Dribbling's nasty. I think he's a four-star not a five-star skill move, but I've done rainbow flicks over to keeper with this guy. Um, he tends to stay on the ball pretty well. His shot is unreal. I mean, he, he's definitely got a B shot. Shoots him from long range, shoots him from short range. Good player. I like him, but uh, he most of the time stays on my bench. 
Essien, this guy's a good player. Again, he's on my bench because I like to, you know, give Nasri and Silva a break here and there. Most of the time, I swap him out with Milner, but Essien's, he's a bench rider on my uh, my FIFA Ultimate team. Excellent, excellent stats. Uh, he's very, very balanced player. He's not doesn't have a really weak spot anywhere. Um, I guess if the weakest spot would be his uh, heading, but other than that, I mean, he's pretty pacey, pretty decent shot. I have hit in a few long range shots with him, but otherwise, playmaker, middle of the field, uh, good player to put in as a sub late in the game, you know, to give a, a fresh pair of legs to your team. Not too bad, but most of the time he rides my bench. Grassic, this guy, wicked pacey, one of my original original uh, goal team players. Bought it for 2000 definitely a good, good pickup. Really, really pacey on the wing, can usually beat people down there nicely. Good shot, decent shot, decent dribbling, four-star skill move, don't think he's five-star, I think he's four. Good player, though, I like him. Rides my bench now, though, because Ben Arfa. Uh, but yeah, he's there. This guy, Zuniga, I got in a pack. I kept him, uh, you know, in the reserves just because if something happens to Micah Richards, then I can have somewhere, someone to sub in the right back. He is in my reserves now. I should probably swap him out, maybe in game. But yeah, not too bad. Raphael Sobeast, this guy is a Sobeast. Freaking A, man. His stats definitely lie. Five star skill move. Pretty pacey at 82, but his shot is not a 74. This guy can blast them in, man. He is wicked. I do like him. I keep him on the bench most of the time because I like to use Fred and Lovetsy mainly on uh, Cavani, too. But this guy, I mean, you bring him in late in the game or something and you just start whipping by people with the skill moves and stuff and blasting them in. He's good. I like him. If you see a lot of the uh, goal compilations online now, this guy just destroys. He's sick. Last but not least is my boy Milner. I had him out. He finally just came back, but he had a red card. Or, uh, yeah, a couple. I think he had a red card. Maybe he was hurt. I don't know. Whatever. He was on my bench. 2,500 coins. One of my first players in FIFA Ultimate Team. This guy is freaking sick. All right. He is incredibly balanced. His pace is decent. His shot is not an 80. This guy, I would say it's an 85 or up. He can blast him in from midfield. He is sick. Very good player. Not a great header, though. He's a shorter guy uh, at 5'9", but really, really good balanced. He can play uh, as attacking mid. Decent defending, too. I don't think that's the 76 does not justice, but very, very good player. Good Good setup guy, but his shot is, I'm telling you guys, it's not an 80. He is probably one of the best uh, deals you can get in FIFA Ultimate Team. Like I said, he, he's been great for me. I've kept him on. He's been one of my main guys. So, sick. Pretty good team. Mainly a premiership squad, like I said. Have a few scattergory guys in there, uh, especially for striker. I kind of do Serie A and uh, guys I like. Lavezzi I picked up from watching other Ultimate Team videos, uh, seeing him do five-star skill moves and have just sick shot. So, that was the pickup that I got from watching your other guys' videos. Fred I picked up. He was actually my first um, striker purchase for a goal guy back in the day. Uh, and like I said, the informed Fred I got from a uh, subscriber. I traded him for the regular Fred, <laughs> which was a wicked steal. So that's my sweaty premiership team. Hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, yeah, FIFA commentaries hopefully be coming again. Maybe do some real life stuff. I've got some announcements coming up pretty soon in the FIFA video world. I will get to that when I can. Uh, I'm sure some of you guys probably already know by now, but yeah, awesome. Appreciate you guys watching this video. Hope you enjoyed the first Wee Peeler commentary for FIFA, and hopefully there's many more to come. All right, talk to you guys later.